Hello and welcome. So in this video, I will discuss about difference between electrostrictive and magnetostrictive transducer. So what is electrostrictive transducers? So electrostrictive transducers works on the principle of piezoelectric effect, whereas the magnetostrictive transducer works on the principle of magnetostriction. So what is piezoelectric effect? So the crystals like topaz and quartz, when put under pressure, generates an electric charge and vice versa is also possible. So let's understand the principle. So this, these are two steel plates and the crystal is put under uh, you can say the crystal is sandwiched under these two steel plates so whenever the pressure is applied to the steel plates it presses the crystal and then charge is generated and vice versa is also possible that whenever we give electric charge to this crystal this crystal starts vibrating so this is piezoelectric effect so now we will understand the principle of magnetostriction so when alternating voltage is applied to the length of the coil this material will always contract irrespective of the direction of the current so if we change the direction of the current at frequent intervals, then there will be compression, expansion and compression of the coil again. So this is the principle of magnetostriction. So first you can say the current is in this direction. Then the nickel coil compressed. Then we will then we change the direction of the current. Then first it will go to zero. So when it will go to zero, it expands back to its original position. And when the current is reversed, it will again compressed. So So this cycle of compression and expression, expansion continues. Now the piezoelectric effect is also used in lighters. In piezoelectric effect, we have burst hull insulation. So what does it mean? So a part of the hull is cut and these type of transducers are fixed over it. So one transducer is used for both transmission and reception. These type of transmissions are in transducers, sorry. So these types of transducers are in direct contact with water. So the magnetostrictive transducers are not in direct contact with water because they are not pierced hull. Hull is not cut to fix these type of transducers. These type of transducers are generally fixed inside fresh water tank. So in, in the case of magnetostrictive transducers, two transducers are used generally. And the advantage of uh, piezoelectric transducer is that it is very efficient. And disadvantage is that piercing of hull is a disadvantage. Whereas the disadvantage of magnetostrictive transducer is that it is not very efficient and the advantage is that no pursing of hull and internal installation. So these are the basic difference that we need to know about magnetostrictive transducer and piezoelectric transducer. So this much is important from this topic and I hope you have liked it. Thank you.